fellow South Africans, I am just only asking for payment of my salary and I'm about to make a phone call to the Secretary of the Minister of Defense following a letter that I have sent to them for them to make payment of my salary. Not available at the moment. Please try again later. And Cindy Sacharo is not available. Let's try um, the office of the Chief of Defense. Zero one two three five five. Sixty, sixty. There. We're calling that one. So on that line, let us go to another line. Secretary of Defense. Secretary of Defense. We are calling it the P of the Secretary of Defense. That's my telemodel. that you will understand here is that uh, it is the availability or accessibility of uh, the administration of the incumbent president Cyril Ramaphosa and then uh, let me go back to Cindy Swa Telephone number you called is not available at the moment. Please try again later. Sandy is not available. And let's come to contacting the CPU Zamene. CPU Zamene. Amen. Oh, come, I don't have your number here. It should be here, mindful. But in any event, we can come and then view it here. Sipuel Lamene, the spokesperson of the minister. Cindy Sacharo, their numbers are there. The minister is there. So you do understand the reality 
uh, that is for the happening here. The numbers are there. Let's do this one. Zero, one, two, three, three, five, five, six, one, zero, eight. We are calling that one now. the number that has been called. And uh, it is as available as you see it here. See, it's the same number. The first one. So that first one, there's no answer. And let's go to the second one. Zero, one, two, three, five, five, six, one, zero, one. Transparency is what I am doing. Without fear, favor, or prejudice. That is transparency. See? There is the number that I'm dialing. It is the number that is shown here. 6101. Fine. There's no one there. Let's call CPU Edelman. Head of communications, and then there I do have his number there. I was looking for it. Let's get them. Hi, Mr. Lamini, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? I'm surviving, man. You're speaking to Mangolele. Uh, Commander Mangolele. Are you with me? I'm saying you're speaking to Commander Mangolele. Yes. Yes, I have sent you an email as a spokesperson of the Minister of Defense requesting payment of my salary following a uh, misrepresentation on the DOD personal system that Come says... Come again, I'm, I'm, the signal is bad. I'm, wh what are you saying? Kere, I'm following in rela I'm following up in relation to the email that I've sent to your office as the spokesperson of the Minister of Defense. Did you send it to me or you send it to a range of people? I have sent it to you also at cpwe dot lamene at uh, dod. Is it directed to me? Yes, it is. It, it, it directed to me and other people. It's directed to 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 all South Africans in simple terms, because uh, I it don't is. Speak on behalf of South Africans. I, I understand. Of the minister and. And the defense force. Yes, I understand, but then it is actually direct. It's a letter directed to the minister, and then I'm struggling to get hold of uh, Cindy Swachwaro, and then I'm also struggling to get hold of the minister on her respective uh, uh, numbers that are available for public to see uh, whether they have uh, received that particular letter and then acting on it as in today. Because uh, I need to go home. My grandmother is sick. I am not in jail as misrepresented in the DOD personal system. That's the fact. I am not supposed but to be... What do you want me to do? I don't want to get into What I want you to do is to uh, 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 check your email. Check your email and then uh, send those two letters that I have sent to the Minister of Defense. I'm not sending them. You're not asking me to send Please, them. Please, I to am. Them. Please, I am talking to you as a person in the spirit of Ubuntu, having jury regard. You're not saying send them. You're 
saying may you kindly send those letters to to so and so please 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 advocate for the kind word uh, uh, my brother you are saying you want letters to be sent to the minister you 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 send those things to i'll check my email and forward the letters to the relevant person <coughs> please that's all i can do Please, but then uh, also advocate on my behalf to them as a person who has access to them to say, I am not in jail. I'm not calling you from jail. Well, I, look, the, the contents of the letter would indicate what, what the issues you want to raise. But I'm not aware whether, I'm not even aware who I'm talking to who, from where, who's in jail, or in New York, or in South Africa. No, I'm in South Africa. I can't get, in, I can't get into details when I have phone the letter. Okay. I'm going to phone the Yeah, and I'll pass it to the relevant people. Yes, and then ask them, ask them for that action today. It is not an issue it of... Is, it is up to them to deal with that. I will send a letter as is for to them, and uh, I'll let them get it from the person who signed it there and, and that's all I can do for now. No, thank you then. God bless you. You're welcome. Thank you, Bob. And uh, that is uh, the Mr. Sipiwe Lamene. And the actual person that I'm actually trying to make sure that they get this particular thing is this person, Cindy Swachwaro. Because by speaking to Cindy Swachwaro and then trust me, even by speaking to uh, it ended, even by speaking to Mr. Lamene, you are speaking to the office of to the office of the minister. And then uh, the Secretary of Defense Because all these people are integrated and intertwined, you understand, and you cannot uh, separate them. They are inextricably linked in the same syndicate uh, that has authority over payment of my salary. And my salary must be paid. I am not in jail as misrepresented in the DOD PESOL system. mailboxing let us try to get a separation director separation Makanya as dire director HR separation these are the people that actually has my money it doesn't matter whether you go to court you don't go to court or anything like that but they have your money. And I, I am not hiding my number. I am not hiding from anybody. I am not hiding anything. You understand, I'm as explicit as I am. It is the fact of law that is happening. All right, now let's go to Corruption Watch. Admiral Makanya's office, Elizabeth, good day. Hi, ma'am, how are you? I'm good, and you? I'm surviving. You are speaking to Commander Mangolele. Yes, can I speak to Admiral Makanya, please? Uh, he went to the meeting and from there he's not coming back to the office. Okay, can you kindly call him on his cell phone and then uh, tell him, let me send you a letter right now. What is your email address for his attention because it has a direct impact on his... Uh, he's regarding what, sir? It's regarding payment of my salary. I sent a letter to the Minister of Defense to tell them that I am not in prison as it is misrepresented in the DOD PESOL system. 
So now that thing needs to be corrected. It's a simple, that's one action that must be made and it must come from that particular office. And then that is why I wanted to give him a copy of that particular letter and then uh, so that uh, he actions or actions the relevant department because the only thing that you need to ask is Mangolele in jail, yes or no, for us to pay his salary. And I'm not calling you from jail. You understand? Mm. Yeah, so go like a kalamaka a simple fella and then people pat kikopa email ya how ma D O D H R S E P at Gmail dot com ne? Yeah. Okay, now let me send you pay salary. Pay salary is the heading. Okay, but Lord, all agree and now, cross key letter to, and then angry care movement. The agitu horaba move, but the langa movement. The key vo key vo man. The Lord some agas fancy di fe let la batu amudi, and then mola out fancy be wa no longore. Oya ko udi mo outlusis. Hmm. I say I say hore. There's no love lost. Mira Meroqua, how Kira Meroqua. So keep up a room of phone, a more phone, no muscle phone. Good day, kindly find, kindly find a touched for your agent action. Sharp. Here I can send a kiyo. No, I want to get a little number. The fellow will grill. Or what kind? Why would this is? So I need to take because me come here now. Asi show ye na afunele met handi mudise or afunele barge mang spokesperson enta tese piyota mene or afunele ko ofisi ya chief defence or afunele ko ofisi ya CHR just to actually I get to appease himself of whatever that he needs to appease himself of. But payment of my salary must be done. Hagi ko tronkong arit ko eleng ho baby sita magaling mo DOD pesol system ka lina la mo tomo. Wai bon it's like ugi la bon abari mo toke mo sadi. Whereas mo toke se mo sadi le monna. And then the next thing by expector what sense make up u uye ko toilet ya basadi u behave like mo sadi u angkutwisis simply because ba toke di bosso it doesn't work like that. That's abuse of power, my bon. So we create them. Okay. Now then, uh, just uh, send an acknowledgement of receipt afterwards, and then call him on his cell phone, forward it on his cell phone, go WhatsApp or get a screenshot. I don't know how he gets it, but he must get it and he must act upon it today. Why would we his ear? Thank you, ma'am. Okay, That was Director HR Separations, Re Admiral Makanya. And then uh, Chief of the South African Navy has received it. And who else is this that I must call? Hmm. Let's get to the chess only. We are calling the Deputy Speaker of Parliament. There is the Telechess at I don't know how busy he is.
don't want to believe a possibility that he is intentionally denying this particular call or ignoring it. Because ignorance is the worst evil on earth. When you ignore somebody, when they are calling you for help, that is evil. And I will prove to it to you according to the people that are clever in this world. I'm still calling Mr. Lechesa Zemali here. And then I will call the Speaker of Parliament. There is the person that I'm calling right now. I want my salary to be paid. I am not in jail as intentionally or unlawfully misrepresented in the DOD personal system. I am not. ended without uh, doing let's get to Admiral Shongwane calling Admiral Shongwane there is his number yeah now he blocked me let's do it the back door way back door copy and then you do this thing it's hash three one hash you must understand to be good people that is a national number that is available to any other person now it will ring but for Mangolele they say it must not be available Hello, sir. How are you? I'm all right. How are you, sir? I'm surviving. Uh, who am I talking to? You're speaking to Sandy Lepeku. Sandy Lepeku. You are speaking to Commander Mangolele, Papa. I have sent an email to you guys and then uh, requesting that payment of my salary be effected. Can you pass the message to the Chief of uh, the Navy that payment okay, of... Can you repeat the message? Sir? You send an me email requesting... Uh, directing that my pay payment of my salary be uh, sent. Didn't you get your email? Is your email... No, what no, is sir, your I'm not the one receiving email. I'm just going to update the message to Admiral. Is it? Okay. Do you have an email address uh, that I can send you this letter to now so that you don't get the dilly dally but give him the actual letter? No, it's fine, sir. If you send it, that means that the office they have it. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm not the one receiving them, so that should have it. Okay, and then uh, just please pass the message to Admiral uh, Longwani that I am not in jail as unlawfully and intentionally misrepresented on the DOD personal system. And that is the only thing that is stopping my salary. When they want to know which jail has contained Mangolele since 8 August 2018, they must produce it to me and the, which Mangolele was that who was uh, arrested and be and convicted to imprisonment for a period not exceeding five years from 8 August 2018, they must tell it to me. The lie on the DOD personal system on my name must be removed and my salary must be paid. That is what I am asking you to tell Vice Admiral Samuel Songwan. I will do so. As a belief, and then ask him to call the Minister of Defense, and then ask him to also call uh, si, uh, Mr. Zamini, Sipiwe Zamini, as head of as the spokesperson of the Minister of Defense. I have spoken to them, and then I have also called uh, Admiral Makanya's office 
at uh, HR separation because they are the ones that uh, must click that particular key and correct that mistake that is done on my name in the DOD PESOL system. Please, my family is suffering. All that I have done as a person in the South African National Defense Force was to save the Navy hundreds of millions and to make sure that the ships go to sea. And each and every time that my salary is not paid, you are caused to believe that I am in jail. It doesn't matter whether the person loves me or don't love me. We are professionals, Hagirko Merko. You understand? Yes. So uh, we, as being professionals, we need to act professionally. I'm not interested in the personalities and personal preferences of other people. I am not asking you about what the chief ate for breakfast this morning. I did not eat anything because I am not paid my salary because of a lie on my name. And that lie, I cast fire on it. It must disappear. For it to disappear, the person occupying the office of the chief of the South African Navy, which is the People's Navy, must take care of his men. It is the w first function of any commander to take care of the well-being of his men. You get what I'm saying? He must do that. Personalities aside here. And the ships need to go to sea. The ships are not going to sea because of corruption. Corruption must end. It's as simple as that. And once corruption ends, the ships will go to sea. There's no hana hanas. It, it does not take a genius. If you say the ships are not going to sea because of corruption, you cannot be going to be fighting flu or fighting the birds or fighting any other thing except the corruption that is stopping the ships from going to sea. Do you get what I'm saying? As a belief. So tell the admiral that I am not in jail and then once he understands that I am not in jail, he will look at the DOD PESOL system. The DOD PESOL system will tell him the reason why Mangwalele is not receiving salary is because of section 105. When you go, you read section 105, you will find that section 105 says a person must be convicted to imprisonment for a period not exceeding five years. I was never charged. I was never called, not even once, to say, Mangolele, you stole a teaspoon or you did this and this and this. I was never, ever, ever called. People just did whatever that they have done and then that lie is now exposed. Let us be true to all our people. Ne? I get my brother. Are you with me? Hello? Okay. Let us leave uh, Vice Admiral Longwani. It's him that we have called here and then he has received the message. I take it so. Good people, I want my salary paid. I am not in jail. Many of you have been lied to and then you have believed that lie, but then you have failed to face the actual facts. What is the fact on the DOD PESOL system about Mangolele? It is section 105. What is the fact about Mangolele? on the DOD system. Leave the lies. Let's leave the lies. Let us start saving and defending our country and its people with integrity. Integrity means honesty, truthfulness, and faithfulness. You cannot say you are a leader but you don't have integrity. And that integrity is wide open. I'm calling upon you in the name of God when he called Adam and said where are you I'm here to cover your nakedness I'm here to take the ships to sea I'm here to take the DOD to new heights 
I cannot do that alone. I cannot do that with lies. I cannot do that with corruption. And in any event, I tell you this truth that Papa Ote, I thank you. Thank mm-hmm. you.